Hi, I'm Brennan from Wilcom with an overview of the new Wilcom Embroidery Studio E4 Update E4.1. Update E4.1 delivers on an array of creative improvements and effects that will inspire any designer, plus a suite of productivity tools that will enhance even the most organized embroidery shop. From new creative stitch types to time-saving tools, plus a new wireless way to transfer designs to your embroidery machine, Embroidery Studio E4 Update E4.1 has something for everyone. Let's start with a tour of our creative design improvements. Forget what you knew about Motive Run and Motive Fill, because we've taken it to a whole new level in Update E4.1. Flexi Motive Column Fill lets you digitize the shape with column A or B and the motive pattern will adapt automatically to your varying column shape, saving you hours of manual digitizing. And with Motive Run, you can now specify a gradient motive size that will smoothly decrease the size of your motive from one end of your object to the next, plus variable size to automatically reduce the size of your motive in tight curves. Contour Fill has had an update as well, including expanding the object types that can use Contour Fill, plus a new fill type called Even Density. Contour Fill is perfect for creating curved fill effects in your design. And now you can create complex shape objects with Complex Fill and apply Contour Fill. And now Even Density adds a new level of creative stitching by forcing the curved contour stitch runs to maintain a visually even density. On top of that, the contour outline has been improved with even sharper and consistent corner stitching. Offsets have always been a great way to automatically create an outline around your design or objects. Well, it's now even better with open offsets. Select any open shape object and select Open Offset. In a simple dialog box, you can specify any number of offset outline objects, including run stitch, back stitch, motive, and of course, satin column C, which now also supports custom column width. While on the topics of offset, You'll also enjoy the new changes we've made to Offset Fill. Offset Fill is now a fully editable object type that dynamically recalculates your offset fill as you reshape. But if you want, you can always break it apart and edit each element individually. The control is in your hands. String stitch is a really remarkable stitch method that originates from India. Known as Pagadi, it is commonly used to sew down small mirrors in intricate embroidery designs. String stitch creates a series of overlapping string art style stitches and can be used for both closed objects, including holes, plus open objects to create some interesting and intricate designs. Sequence Stamp is a new creative way to make multi-color or multi-pattern sequin designs. Simply create a stamp, then apply that stamp to a sequin fill object. Specify a new sequin color or shape for your stamped area. And you instantly have a design ready to challenge even the best sequin designs hanging off a retail shelf. Next, we have Sequin Smooth Edges. You can now change your row and column spacing from the current exact grid method to expand to fit or contract to fit. The end result is the line of sequin will either expand or contract to fit perfectly into your shape and create a consistent and smooth sequin edge.
In a world of custom everything, having the ability to create your own sequence shapes is a marketable value add to your business. Create or import any vector shape, including a fixing stitch hole, and convert it to a predefined sequence shape in Embroidery Studio E4.1. Once defined, you can select your custom shape, define a color and size, and apply it to a sequin run or sequin fill object. With a custom sequin shape, now comes the need for a custom sequin fixing stitch, which is now available in Embroidery Studio E4 Update E4.1. Simply open our Create Sequin Fixing dialog box, give your pattern a name, then plot your sequin fixing stitch on screen, including defining the sequin drop command. The on screen snap lines help you define an accurate fixing shape and can be adjusted to suit the intricacy of your custom sequin design. Once created, you can select and apply your custom fixing stitch to your sequin design. A new single sequin element add on is now available for Embroidery Studio decorating. You can create elaborate single sequin designs using a single sequin size and color per object with digitizing tools such as Sequin Run, Manual Sequin, and Sequin Fill. Now for our productivity improvements. Building designs from stock designs and clip art just got a whole lot easier. The new clip art docker lets you browse any design folder and previews the embroidery design content. Search, then select and drag your design components on screen. You're free to make any change and create a brand new design. Your feedback told us how much you loved the design library in E4. Well, it just got a whole lot better and a whole lot faster in Update E4.1. With Design Library, you can preview and locate designs in folders that you've added to your embroidery library. Simply type your search query and matching designs will appear instantly. Designs are searched by file name, but also by information fields such as tags plus order information including customer name, order number, and reference number. For even more accurate search results, you can limit your search filtering to options such as design title, file name, design status, order date, and more. Thanks to your feedback, we've enhanced the job order feature to enrich the valuable information we save in your Wilcom embroidery files. The job order feature now supports color and size quantity information that is saved directly inside your Wilcom.emb file. Simply add size columns, then color rows, and fill in the quantities. The color and size information is now saved forever in your embroidery file and will print on your PDF approval sheet. With the update E4.1, you can better customize the approval sheet options. Customer information is now included with the order information and terms and conditions can now be excluded as preferred. Barrett and machine users will love this new improvement. Embroidery Studio E4 Update E4.1 now supports the Barrett FDR3 U03 machine file format. The Barrett FDR3 file supports correct thread color display in its thumbnail in both the design library plus on the Barrett machine. This will help eliminate costly production errors resulting from incorrect colors. And now, the best for last. Embroidery Connect is a new add-on element that will revolutionize the way you send embroidery designs to your machine. Embroidery Connect is a new add-on element for Embroidery Studio E4. Simply enable the new element and add a compatible Wi-Fi USB stick to any machine. 
You can send designs directly to any machine with a compatible Wi-Fi USB stick from any computer on your network. And the designs are stored on the USB stick ready for your machine to load. This improvement alone could save you hours of managing and transferring designs to your machines every single day. Thanks for your time, and I hope you enjoy Wolfcom Embroidery Studio E4 with Update E 4.1.